Welcome back to JNY Cards, where we are going to be enjoying this amazing hobby together. Today is episode 295, and we're going to be opening up two blaster boxes of 2022 Topps Heritage Baseball. I'm a big fan of Heritage, um, and, I, and I've got some interesting theories as to why I think I'm such a big fan of Heritage Baseball. Part of it is mainly hype. You know, the season just started, and for about two months-ish, all you can find is opening day, Series 1, and Heritage. And so sometimes you get a little tired of opening up Series 1, and so you want a little something else, so then you dabble into Heritage, right? And Heritage is great because it kind of fills this niche of more vintage-designed cards, while Series 1 and opening day fits that niche of more modernly designed cards. And so, that's my theory. Um, and so, what we're going to do is, before we open these, we're actually going to... I'm at, sorry, I just got a notification on my phone here. Bloop, 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 bloop. Okay, sorry about that. Do not disturb. Okay, here we go. Okay, I think we're still good over here as well. Yes, all right. So, before we open up these two blaster boxes, which I already cut them open, you all should consider subscribing because once I hit 200, sorry, once I hit 325 subscribers, I'm going to give away this hanger box of 2020-21 Chronicles Basketball. And once I hit 350 subscribers, I'm going to give away this blaster box of 2021-22 Tops Champions League UEFA Soccer. Right? And to enter my giveaways, all you have to do is be a public subscriber, and you'll automatically be entered into winning them. All right? So what we're going to do, we're going to open these up and talk about Heritage Baseball just a little bit more, and then we're going to get ripping. So these have 72 cards total. It's an 8 by 9 product. And we are looking for, let me see here. It should say like red. Where does it say? Red, red. It doesn't say it anywhere. We could potentially find autographs and relics. We could potentially find 1973 Venezuela stamps. And this is a Target product, so we're also going to find candy lids. So if you're interested, feel free to pause the video and view those, read through those pack odds if you want. But enough babbling here. Let's rip open some heritage here. I haven't op opened up heritage in a little while. Um, I've been busy with finishing up series one and opening a Bowman and dabbling a little bit in other stuff like Donruss. But you know what? I've got two more blaster boxes of, sorry, I've got four more blaster boxes of Heritage and two more Megas to open up. So we're going to be opening those up this upcoming week, or most of it this upcoming week. And again, these are Target Heritage blaster boxes, so they're going to have the candy stamps, they're not going to have the comic strip cards. I really like the comic strip cards, but um, my Walmarts are selling these for like 28 bucks, and I'm just like, man, I don't want to pay 28 bucks for blaster box of Heritage when I can pay $22 or $20, um, or yeah, $23 or $21 at Target and Barnes and Noble. So, but you know what? I have not pulled a Wander Franco rookie card out of Heritage yet. So hopefully that happens today. Let's see what we got. We got Chapman, Shane Baz rookie card. We got Sonny Gray, Dominic Smith, John Means, Brett Phillips, 1973 flashback card. Ooh, O'Neal Cruz. And Max Freed, there we go. That's a nice rookie card to get right there. Mr. O'Neal Cruz. All right, next pack here. We got Jake McGee. Uh, Jesus Aguilar, rookie outfielders. 
We got Kevin Gossman, Jared Walsh, Seth Brown, Jose Abreu, Luis Robert, and Tristan McKenzie. Good old Sticks McKenzie. All right, next pack here. We got James McCann, Shane Bieber, Mookie Betts. Ooh, looks like we got some. Ooh, we got a chrome here. Uh, Jorge Alfaro, Kale Quantrill, and behind him we've got a... So I'm going to save that chrome for later. Uh, we got a high number here of Asan Diaz, Alex Dickerson, and David Fletcher. Very nice. Cool, we got a chrome card. So chrome cards are 1 out of 18, and the chrome refractors are 1 out of 76 packs. So that's not too bad. Tyler Anderson, Manuel Rodriguez, Steven Matz, DJ Peters, Ramel Tapia, Luis Arise, Brian De La Cruz, there's a good rookie, Jake Cronenworth, and Anthony Offord. Very cool. Okay. Next pack here. What did I say? I think it's, you get eight packs. Eight packs total. So this is pack number four, right? Pack number five. You got Kevin Piar, Austin Riley, Leary Garcia, Jesus Lazardo, Edmundo Sosa, Marcus Simeon, Cole Irving, Colton Wong, and Tyler O'Neill. Man, no rookies in that pack or inserts. And I'll go through all these cards later and see if I got any short prints as well. Emmanuel Rivera, there's a good rookie. Nick Solak, Eloy Jimenez, Matt Barnes, Joe Ryan, there's another good rookie. Matt Olson, and we had another high number card of Yusmero Petit. Very nice. We had a gold cup of Dylan Carlson and Jake Fraley. All right. Pack number seven here, Luis Urias. Josiah Gray, rookie card. Nico Horner, um, World Series card. Max Muncy, Michael Pineda. Oops. And we got a 73 flashback there. Lucas Giolito and Gio Ursula. And we've got one more card here. All right, Wander. Feel free to show up anytime now. Gene Segura, Vladimir Guerrero. We got uh, ERA leaders for the NLAL. Tony Santolin, rookie card. Dallas Keiko, Chas McCormick, rookie. Oh, very nice. Francisco Lindor. Very cool. Candy. What are these called? Candy tops or something like that? Let's see. Candy lids. Interesting. All right, so we'll put him. It's already, like, falling apart. <clears throat> we'll put him right there. Robbie Ray and Nick Madrigal. All right, so let's see. <clears throat> This is the hit of the box here. We got a chrome here. Oops. I think I already know who it is. Jose Barreos. Very nice. Holy cow, that looks freaking beautiful. Wow. And it's numbered out of 999. So I do not know if this is a chrome or a chrome refractor. I am not too sure. I think this is just a chrome. A chrome refractor, I feel like you would see more rainbowish colors so but still a chrome i'll take that any day all right so let's see if we hit a hot box here so this next box right here hot boxes have like purple parallels in them you get one purple parallel per pack i opened up one box last year it was a high number and no parallel so this is not hot box here we got Carlos Rendon, Michael Taylor, Mike Zunino, Adoles Garcia, Gold Cup, Alberto Mondese, uh, batting leaders, batting average leaders. Uh, Brandon Marsh, rookie, that's a good one. Lance Colors Jr. and Josh Naylor. All right. Pack number two, we got Mr. Willie Aramis, Christian Javier. Sean Murphy, Anthony Discofani, Tyler Wade, Alex Bregman, and we've got Freddie Freeman. Oh, that's cool. That's a high number as well. Kenley Jansen and Avasil Garcia. All right, Wander, where are you at? 
Feel free to make an appearance. I've opened up, this is my fifth blaster box. I've opened up four so far and no Wander yet. But we did, I think I've got a couple O'Neill Cruises, so that's not too bad. Mike Moustakis, Yuan Moncada, Devin Williams, Brandon Woodruff, Brendan Rogers, Ronnie Dawson, rookie card, a Den and Now, very nice. Dan Spee Swanson and Corey Dickerson. All right, let's move on to the next pack here. We've got Nico Goodrum. Tyler Molly, AJ Pollock, Didi Gregorius, Dylan Cease, Justin Upton, Jose Ramirez, Ryan Presley, and Romy Gonzalez rookie card. Not too bad. Let's see here. Pack number five. We're halfway through the last box here. We got Walker Bueller, Jan Gomes, Aaron Nola, Lourdes Gurriel Jr., Mike Pivetta. Mayo Straw and a heart. Our high number is of Josh Van Meter. And we've got 2021 rookie pitchers. Not too bad. And Zach Plesak. Pack number seven here. JP Crawford, Julio Urias, J DJ LeMahieu, World Series card. Chris Taylor, Ozzy Elbies, Brandon Marsh, New Age Performers. Nice. Jed Lowry, and Jacob Stallings. All right, Wander, come on now. Don't elude me like this. We got Alex Kirloff. That's nice. Josh Hader, Taylor Knight, uh, Taylor, Taylor Naquin, Max Kranick, Adam Wainwright, John Lester, Christian Vasquez, Tiasco Hernandez, and Freddie Peralta. All right, last pack here. Last pack magic. Come on now. Let's Hold that wander. That'd be awesome if we could. So we got our third high number card here. We got Blake Snell, Ryan Valade, Luke Voigt, Wilson Contreras, Tom Murphy, Jonathan India Gold Cup, and our high number is Wilmer Defoe. Followed by IKF and Jordan Luplo. All right, not too bad. No wander, but we got an, an O'Neill Cruz. I'm going to sleeve up everything, and we'll come back with a recap, all right? All right, so let's do this recap here. So, we here are our high number cards. We got four, five of them because instead of getting a six one, we got a chrome card there. And so, I mean, these are okay. The best one is definitely Freddie Freeman. Oh, and I also double-checked all of my base here, and... I didn't get any short prints or variations or anything like that. So these are all just regular base cards. Let's look at our rookies, though. We got two Brandon Marshes, Joe Ryan, Rivera, Valade, and De La Cruz, New Age Performers, and the O'Neill Cruz, which is super nice. It's a little off-centered. It's heavy on the right, but, you know, the back, uh, back looks okay. But yeah, but the best card I want to say is probably this Barrios one, number two, $9.99. That's nice. I really like that. I think that's just a regular chrome card. Oh, yeah, I forgot about Francisco here. There's our candy lid. Wait, I only got one candy lid? I should have gotten two candy lids. Unless it's, like, stuck to a card somewhere. I don't think I missed it. Let me see here. Nope, no candy lid. No candy lid. Yeah, I'm not seeing it. Tops shorter than the candy lid, but that's okay. I think they're, the candy lids are honestly kind of dumb, but compared to the comic cards that you get from Walmart. But anyways, yeah, there it is. Two Heritage Blaster boxes. I'm going to be opening up. Like I said, I've got four more Heritage Blasters and one more Heritage Mega that I'm going to be opening up for the channel. So please, subscribe, click that notification bell so you don't miss it. While you're at it, click that like button too and drop a comment down below. All of you out there, please take care of yourself and I'll see you all in the next video.